Take a leg, Max. It's a rock. It's a rock. Mount Badrich. It's the inexplicable valley of lights. It's a rock. That's the Enchanted Argyle Forest. It's a rock. Hmm, it's a rock. And it's between the two things Shavul said it was between. It must be Frog Rock. I think I can see Frog Rock. Frog Rock. It's a swatch of Bruno's fur. Better not waste this stuff until I smear all three Sasquatch samples on this rock. That's gross, Sam. Well? Wait for it. Sure gets dark quickly around here. I don't think this is a natural occurrence, Max. In fact, I think we're witnessing a celestial convergence of some sort. Do you think it'll make that rock look more like a frog? Yeah. 
This means something, Sam. It's a Conroy world after all. If we ever get this rich and famous, I want you to shoot me, Sam. It'll be a pleasure. A wishing well. I wish I had absolute power to decide who lives and who dies. I think we'd need a bigger well. this game were over. Hold it! Get back here. We're dealing with a very literal well here. Cripes! Hey, Max, take a look at this. It's titled Me, Myself, and I. Hey, you learned how to read. Howdy, partners. I'm Conroy Bumpus, and welcome to Bumpusville. Feel free to wander the mansion, but for Pete's sake, don't touch anything. Howdy, partners. It's a portrait of John Muir. Say, Sam, just who is John Muir? Who's John Muir? Hey, guys, this dope doesn't know who John Muir is. You gotta be kidding. What a maroon. What a dib cow poop. Sam, the dead animal heads are talking to me. Where? Up there. Well? But... You really shouldn't tell fibs about dead animals, Max. But... Stop bugging me. I'm admiring this portrait of John Muir. But who's John Muir? Do you really want to know? If you'll stop talking, sure. Okay. Hit it, boys. There once was a man named John Muir. A naturalist, noble and pure. His love for all beasties. The most and the leasties. Has never been equaled. Um. Uh... For sure! It's a macro hard maintenance droid. This is Conroy's first guitar. It says here that he practiced diligently for two weeks, then gave it up and hired a backup band. That story warms the cockles of my heart. So do car crashes. Bumpusville is proud to present the master of melody, the king of country, Mr. Entertainment, Conroy Bumpus. I hate floor shows. I remember my childhood in Brighton When dear old dad would bounce me on his knee He'd say, son, there ain't nothing as exciting As exposing beasts to inhumanity that's why I'm At 
day to be king of the creatures. I'm proud to be the lord of the old. I love collecting things with grotesque features. It makes me feel like some Chaldean god. Oh, I trapped my first tiger before I could speak. Killed me a bear when I was free. And now with this Bigfoot and giraffe neck freak, I finally have a full menagerie. Hit it, boys! That's why. Country Western Star. Thank you, thank you. Your attention, please. Conroy Bubbis has left the building. Hey, Bruno! <coughs> hey, Trixie! It's Monster Truck Weekend! Happening every Sunday. Sunday! Sunday. Okay, I'm over the shock now. I'm not, but I'm sure my gentle naivete will survive. It's a pillow, and you it's got miracle grow hair tonic all over it. I don't want to strain myself. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. It looks like an official macro heart maintenance droid manual. If I had the slightest inclination to strain myself, I could probably reach it. However, I'm sure I can drag this out into a longer yet more satisfying experience. What you doing? Hang back, buddy, and observe my magic. Oops. Find out all you need to know? Maybe. I got a little lost in the troubleshooting chapter. You're the cheap thug who helped bump us five iron my little buddy. If my guns weren't at the cleaners, you'd be Swiss cheese, bub. Look, it's nothing personal. I was just following orders. Besides, I sort of enjoyed it. So, what's all this virtual reality equipment for? The way I understand it, Mr. Bumpus uses a sophisticated virtual reality scenario to interface with the mansion security system. The devil, you say? The devil! The devil! 
Yeah, sometimes Mr. Bumpus lets me use the equipment. I pretend I'm over a hundred feet tall and everyone else is like ants and I just squish, 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 squish. We get the picture. So, what's this Conroy Bumpus Yahoo really like? Has he got any deep, dark secrets we can exploit for monetary gain? Hey, don't be casting no aspirations toward Mr. Bumpus. He busted me out of the youth camp, gave me this high-paying 475 an hour job, taught me how to speak Swahili, found a baboon's heart for my sister's transplant operation, and he sings real pretty too. How can you stand to work for someone who persecutes harmless beasts like Bruno the Bigfoot? Uh, on my feet? He's got you there, Sam. Don't you have any misgivings about hunting harmless freaks like Trixie? I did, but then I took a couple aspirin. Ah, skip it. Hey! Visitors ain't allowed to use Mr. Bumpus' state-of-the-art virtual reality equipment. Scram! Now that I've read that ponderous manual, I can move the robot around like this. I'm impressed. That's nothing. Watch this. Help me, Sam and Max! You're my only hope! That was gratuitous. Sorry. This might be more useful. I don't think the cute little robot wants to follow its new programming, Sam. I don't recall giving it a cute little choice. There he goes. I'm ripe with anticipation. I thought I smelled something. What the? How Pavlovian. And you should know. This is virtual reality? I may be sick. Well? I am the Key Master. Does that come with a dental plan? I don't know what you two critters are up to, but I want you out of here. Now!